uh, taarifa tunayokuleta hivi sasa ni kwamba serikali inakariri kwamba usalama umeimarishwa huko kaimu waziri wa usalama daktari Fred Matiangi akisema kwamba mikakati ya kutosha imewekwa kuhakikisha kwamba uchaguzi wa alhamisi utafanyika kwa njia huru na haki Matiangi amesisitiza kuwa uchaguzi utafanyika kama ilivyopangwa na tume ya uchaguzi nchini IEBC Nicolas Wambua anatuarifu Zime salia siku mbili kuandaliwe marudio ya uchaguzo rais hapa nchini Kenya. Kinara wa NASA Raila Odinga amezidi kuwa hakikishio fuasi wake kwamba hakuna uchaguzi utafanyika. Lakini upande mwingine jubili na shikilia uchaguzi utafanyika kama ilivyoratibiwa na tumehuru ya uchaguzi na mipaka. Ni misimamo ya pande hizi mbili ambayo imezidi kuzwa tumbo joto kwa wa Kenya ila wakuu salama wana haya ya kusema we are ready not only to support the IBC in collaboration with other agencies including ourselves to enable IBC discharge its mandate we are at a place we have not been to before passions uh, uh, fairly strained in the country right now emotions are running high hata hivyo waziri wa usalama wa ndani daktari Fred Matiangi ametoa onyo kwa wafuasi wa NASA wenye nia ya kuvuruga uchaguzi and those of us who do not wish to live in an orderly way the law again allows us and gives us a way in which we will persuade them to live in an orderly way all it to our people to provide a safe and a secure environment to enable those who wish to vote to do so, to enjoy that right in a peaceful environment. And those who do not wish to vote are equally given the space to enjoy that right of their own privacy. Wakuo salama wanasema kuwa idadi ya maafisa usalama imiongezwa maeneo ambayo kuna hatari ya kuvurugika wakati wa marudio ya uchaguzi matanya akiweka wazi kwamba wako tayari kuhakikisha uchaguzi umefanyika kwa amani wakati kaimu usalama wa ndani Fred Matiangi akisisitiza kuwa lazima uchaguzi ufanyike tarehe 26 amewahakikishia wapiga kura kwamba watakuwa na usalama wa kutosha Nicolas Mbwa KTN News Nairobi